this point, I think we're just going with it. It's right? yeah. going to be cloudy. I, you might as well just enjoy your summer. It's the first week out of we, school for many kids. Yes. We just want to get out there. I agree. You know what? The kids are out of school, and I think that people are just like, you know what? Uh, sun or clouds, uh, we're going to head out to the beach yeah. and just enjoy no matter what. Uh, you know, and you just got to do what you got to do because uh, we're going to continue with the June gloom this weekend for most of us. The good news is next weekend's looking better, even as we head into the latter part of the work week. Satellite radar showing us gray skies for all of us today. Look at that. As we zoom in a little bit closer, we're even seeing a little bit of moisture out through Fraser Park. But other than that, still seeing some dry conditions for most of us. However, we could start seeing a little bit more moisture as we head into tomorrow. As far as temperatures outside, we're in the 60s for a lot of us, a few low 70s in Saugus, into Van Nuys, even parts of the Inland Empire, not too bad. But again, gray skies for most of us. It is warm out in the Coachella Valley with upper 80s at the 5 o'clock hour in Palm Springs. As we take a look at our future tracker, you'll notice, yes, a little bit of rain developing as we head into tomorrow morning. Look at that. We'll even see some cells of some more moderate to heavy rain out through some of our high deserts. And as we take a look at Sunday afternoon, we're still seeing a little bit of lingering moisture. So tomorrow's going to be a better day to see a few light showers and then even potentially lingering into the early part of Monday. But other than that, as we head into Tuesday and beyond, really things start improving. So here's a look at our weather story, a cool and cloudy weekend with some drizzle and light rain. Thunderstorm activity not out of the question, especially for our mountain areas as we head into tomorrow. And then we'll still continue with the cloudy conditions for at least Tuesday afternoon. And then the improvements for the latter part of the week. Temperatures slowly start to rise. We start getting a little bit more sunshine. And uh, really a pretty nice weekend as we head into the next one. Tomorrow's high is uh, still a cool one. Well below average in the 60s for most of us. So we even have some 80s out through Palm Springs. And taking a look at the seven-day forecast, finally back to average as we head into the latter part of the week with some mid-70s back for L.A. Inland Orange County, which is uh, right where we should be for this time of year. For the valleys, uh, still a chance of getting some showers tomorrow, 70s for most, most of the week, and then those 80s return by Friday, Saturday. For the Inland Empire, a pretty similar trend, actually even a little warmer with 80s back by Wednesday upper 80s by the end of the week and for the beaches temperatures look at that finally after a very long wait you're going to be back in the mm. 70s uh, also by friday and saturday <laughs> with a little bit more sunshine so i know a lot of us have been waiting for that so the santa monica pier is going to look a little bit different all Maybe even more us. packed. All of us have been waiting for that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I think we'll be more packed. And we'll keep waiting until next weekend. <laughs> yes. Thanks so much, Olga. Thanks, Olga. CBS 2 is now CBS Los Angeles. CBS News Los Angeles. Your local news. Streaming wherever, whenever.